All right, two new items, Minofsky Drive and the Rescue Unit, which is basically like a med pack and power pack. Actually, equip that, I think. Um, Ooh, got some open spots. Uh, Black Selena. Let's put this on the Strike Freedom Gundam. Ah! I can finish that a little bit later. We've got one more, because it does apply to the next DLC mission. So let's just do that. It's Quieting Clash. And after this one, we'll level up our robots some more, because we've got much more cash. Our heroes have been transported to the Universal Century Dimension, and their only tactical an analyst, Nine, finds herself seized by profound un uneasiness. This is picking up right where... This is setting up, set up exactly where we are at the story right now, before we've made our big decision. wrong, Nine. Your face is all scrunchy. I'm perfectly fine. I did all you want. I always know when you're worried, Nine. Oh, don't look so surprised. You always know what I'm thinking, right? Well, it goes both ways. And I think my prize should be you telling me what you're thinking. I've been parsing in me data from our previous battles. It's only served to confirm their ominous nature. And now you're worried, but you may be overthinking things. You were just scared of all the other enemies that we beat. Or you're just as scared of all the other enemies we beat. But if we were to suffer a simultaneous attack from the classes that compromise their core strength, that comprise their core strength, then we'll win. Definitely. Er, and I could prove it. We can have, we'll have Confessor Sonata cook up a special simulation. If we link his and your data on our mecha, we can make any battle we want. We could... We can even do the one that's got you so worried. If we win it, then that should nip your worries right in the bud. Okay, sis, I'll make sure everything is ready. Then you bit off more than you can chew there, Jose. Oh, we get to pit. Oh, we get to select the base to sortie. So we can't do the the Danon, and we can't do the Yamato itself. Ptolemaeus, and we can do. From, uh, when you do, uh, the Nondisco. Uh... I say the Nondisco because it's got the map gun. Oh, I guess I'm sorting both of them. Okay, never mind. And then... 15 robots. Oh, this is neat! Okay, I like this. So this is like optional boss rush. No, I don't want those. Those. Alright. So our, all the pilots we have this sortie here are our highest level pilots as well. Or these everyone's operating at level 23. Okay. The Gundam. The Gundam. The Kai Kai. One. Um, we pretty heavily upgraded. I don't know if 
if our upgrade levels are applicable for this. I hope they are. Part two. Guard Diver, Black Selena, and go with the Huckabee. Wow, this is really something. Both I and Sonata worked on it. This is a multi six simulator, it's of my finest work. Wow, New Bull Tokyo City looks so real. It means the enemy should be spot on. Everything's ready here. Fire it up, Nine. Hey, <laughs> I can't wait to see what happens. Well then. Whoa! We fought all of these and barely came out alive. The gambling ships attacked the Yamato and Pluto. And to the commander ship that gave pursuit. Er, Kincaid, is that... Probably a biobrain clone of Amber Array's battle data. Say that again? Oh, yes, I was hoping for this line. I also see DG Alliance, Joe the Ace, and Hokushin. There's even a group of great class dragons. This is serious stuff. Damn, even Ghoulie from Garden. These are the enemies that you'll be facing. But feeling that to be insufficient, Outcommander Okita and I have decided upon a special rule. enemy will attempt to make it across this line. It will be your job to hold them back. You're telling us we gotta hold the line against all of these guys? Even with all our training, don't you think this is a bit much? So said that we would win. Hey, uh, you're telling me Chitose is the reason we have to put up with this crap? Think you might have oversold it a bit, Chitose? Don't say that, Shin. I'm kind of regretting it now. It's not like we have a choice. You might see this for real in the future. Be good practice. Right. We'll have to give it our best shot. Yes, we should at least try it before you complain. Well then, Commander Okita, hold the line against the enemy forces. Every enemy unit is incredibly powerful. There will be no room for error. Do your best, everyone. Wait a second, Nine. You need to fight with us. Okay. And the little of Christmas Eve, those are the main game. All right. So, yep, there's Glee. There's Wolfgang. Go the Ace. Hokushin. All of Hokushin Six. Oi Cow Low. Voitan. Yep, the Amakusha. Amakusha. I want to see what happens if Amaro fights the. Uh... Now let's move forward. Tricky bit is because we got the hold the lot the hold the line thing going on. Can I get you on top of the ship on the buildings? Um Spread out a little bit. But otherwise, like Hokushin and company will race right past us. Fortunately, facing isn't exactly as much of a thing in this game. Good 
good news is the way this is set up was the layout is set up you to have the robots operating in flanks. Each flank being supported by a super by a, a capital ship. Or fronts rather. Each with each front being supported by a capital ship that can that can support and resupply as needed. will push up the center. Then we move up there. Thanks, everybody. Yep. And if we lose this one, I'm not going to do, do a redo on this. Um... I think a mission fail on this is just as legit a scenario as a mission success narrative, from a narrative standpoint. But the whole point is, do we think we're ready for this as we currently stand? All right. Vitarn is ready to attack. Oh, boy. Um... Uh, I'll cheat with the music anyway. Wow, it's a regular hit on that. Sets up some serious damage. Does some serious damage to Hawkinson's six. That's your pretty good hit chance. Okay. Operating from position here, where I have a uh, where these are. Alright. I have a map skill basically used. Drop their hit chance a little bit. The next time I will finish things. Uh, I'm sure you will. So don't want to get hit. Like, this is basically the boss rush fight. Alright, we 
the very edge of their range. Boy, Cal Lowe's got a big mess of hit points. I like this one because it, dro it drops their mobility. If I get hit, I'm going to be in real big trouble though, so, um, boost my evasion a little bit. Ow, okay, that really hurt. Six in the front rank here. Right. Okay, this is going to be a tricky one. Let's change up the music a bit. Get the lady sax going. Almost got him. Okay. Good support position. Alright, she might actually miss. That's good. I'm gonna hit quicker because I really don't want to Because Guard Diver is here as a he as a healer more than anything else. Finish him, but it softened him up a bit. And on the other flank. You and Ghoulia, your obsession with speed. I probably want to check out the three forward a bit. Focus him right in the middle of the air attack area. Now I'm going to move forward so I can get a good support position.
Amaral versus the dragon. Let's change and let's change up the tune again. Alright. I want to see Amaral fighting a dragon. His lion here is. I can have Amaro swing over to attack with the Black Selena as needed. And if we use Distortion Attack and Hocus and Six, because it's Barrier Breaker. Oop! I want to stick with the music, that's okay. Yeah, Soften it up pretty good. Take Alright. The left flank is probably in a really bad way here, so I think we're... Well... They're both pretty bad, just for different reasons. I need to clear the center quick, and then have those, those forces swing out, sweep out to the left and right. So this goes. Alright. Crap, one one boost by. Okay. There's Schultz and Le Chevalier. Um Now about crap's the best attack we got. Two just blew right by. Um, but Shamai is going down. Okay. Um. I lose money! Retreat! Retreat! Yeah, she's the bad way. Versus Ryoma. Okay, it's be interesting. Uh, assist again. So I can tank this. Nice, serious damage, Joe the Ace. 
Oh, that's not good. Uh, that's not good at all. And then, just for measure, let's <laughs> let's do the evade ability here, so we don't get clobbered. Down. Okay. My apologies, Captain. So you're out of it. Good. Take the hit. You, you'll see me again. Treating. Okay. Focusion six is almost entirely down. And here's Hokushin himself taking a Kincaid. so we can start the attack. And the dragons are basically just ignoring this. Which is kind of crappy. Okay. This is the problem. We have at least two ships that are straight, just ignoring our forces. So have Tobia try to finish off the bio brain. Hope this hits and does enough damage. I can't believe you cloned Bamro's data and put it in a bio brain. The question is, which Amro is better, this dimension or our own dimensions? Boom. Oh, I should use the uh you know this right. Gravity blast on on her Torah. Actually, you know what? Alright, so there's a 100% hit chance. You make this a crit. Okay, we will tank that with the barrier. Have Banjo Harren finish them off. Hopefully. Yep, we got him. I'm leaving the battlefield. Do your best to win this fight. Okay, that's good. All right, I'll move you over here. Do the double invincible assault. Schultz, 100% hit chance this time. And have Shimaraki use for C to make sure that they're able to survive the attack. Oh. 
Actually, oh, we got fine. Didn't like doing that, but we also don't want to have a uh, have them hit us last past us. All right. All right have you finish off? I have a chance. Hopefully, that's enough. No, it's not enough. You hit, but we don't. Okay, because we missed. Let right. me finish you off because you're about to pull past us. So, Black Gator Strike. You're out of it. There'll be time for redemption. We're leaving this battle. All right. Focus on six may blast right past us. We're not careful. Um. I'm gonna hit chance. It'll work. I guess that's it. I'm retreating. Six is out. All right. Now, if, oh, you're too close to Yamato to hit you. They can hit pretty much anything else, more or less. Not really. Actually, uh, Halfway's got 96% hit chance. Um, against Vermog. And Vermog is uh, under 15 hit chance. I'll just play this as is. Problem. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.